All right, let's talk about reactions of carboxylic acids. Carboxylic acids, and here's an example of one, are used in a process called esterification. I react uh, this carboxylic acid with an alcohol. I need a catalyst like uh, H2SO4, which is giving me H+. Uh, I need to heat this guy. Uh, what's going to happen is this H is going to come out. This OH is going to come out. I'm going to get water made, and I'm going to get these two things, this carbon, attaching onto that O. So I'm going to get a three-carbon chain with hydrogens. I'm going to get my O, and now I'm going to get this guy attached on here. Yes. Um, so I've made an ester and water, esterification. Um, these things can also be reduced. Currently, I am making three bonds to O more, or sorry, reduction. I'm going to make less bonds to O. So less would be two bonds to O or one. So I can reduce this to that. Yes. And this is all depending on what I get. Uh, or what I use, I could reduce this down to a diol, yes, because that's still two bonds to O. I could reduce this, continue to reduce this down to just an alcohol, right? And I guess if I kept going crazy and continued to reduce, I could just get all the way back to plain old propane. Oxidation. Um, you need to make more bonds to O. Currently, I am making three bonds to O. More would be four bonds to O. But carbon only makes four. So if it's making four bonds to O, it's not really an organic molecule anymore. There's no hydrogen anymore in it. Um, so um, oxidation reactions do not for a carboxylic acid. Okay. And then I can make a salt. Um, I'm going to react this carboxylic acid with um, sodium hydroxide, or it could be a different thing. It could be um, barium hydroxide. Yes. It doesn't really matter what it is. What's going to happen? Same thing uh, as in so many other reactions. The H is coming off. The OH is coming off. Um, this is OH minus, that means that it's Na plus. This is H plus, so this must be an O minus on this chain, yes? Um, so uh, the Na plus is coming over here to join up with that. So these are the reactions that carboxylic acids undergo.